Hello, good day. This is Hunter 357 and today we're gonna review this. It's a Pika Palooza. Um, it's a, a, a DIY guitar pick maker and it's used to make your own picks. So let's check it out. This is how I got it out of the Amazon box. And here's the package at the back. It says it's, it has the guide. Slide any thin piece of plastic into pick up a loose line it up, press it down. Okay. Let's open it up. Alright. And it's quite heavy. You know those heavy duty staplers that you can find there? It's as heavy as that. And I'm pretty sure it's about maybe a pound in weight or something, or maybe more. About that but it's heavy so it, it does look like a stapler or a puncher anyway so this is what I got out of the box nothing else and this is how it looks like it has this thing holding it so let's remove that so that's how it looks like it has a very cool guitar logo right there it's a Picapalooza logo I guess there, there. So I think they're gonna punch whatever card you have there okay for the sake of review I'm gonna use this um, old credit card not really credit card but like a debit card and a gift card alright so based on the instructions it says there just slide it in line it up to the image that you want it and then punch it so like that I want to see the Walmart there so I can have a, a Walmart pick let's see if you guys can see it there all right I think that's good enough and I'm gonna push so it's there press down on the handle and the guitar pick is born so press down something flies out let me get that but there you go, as you can see, pick is gone. And here I got a Walmart pick. Alright, so that's with that. Then let's try another one with the with the credit card, debit card. And for this I wanna maybe have the eagle there. So let's try it out. Alright, I'm lined up and fire. It's quite hard to press onto this, so if yeah, there you go. If you need help, feel free to get someone who can actually help you. Alright. So I'm guessing that has a security feature on that credit card or debit card because I have a different kind of edge here. I don't know what it is, but it kind of looks like metallic or something. So on this one, on this other card, I actually have a, like the Walmart gift card is much more smoother than this one. I don't know if it's because of the eagle right there. You know what? I'm going to try the other side here. Let's see. It's actually the debit card is harder to punch than the gift card. There you go. And again, the credit card or the debit card has a different kind of edge there. It actually doesn't feel smooth, as smooth as the gift card. So I'm gonna say probably it will be depending on what you're gonna use. And um, let's see. So, this is a regular pick that I have. I forgot the size of it, but this is a pick, a guitar pick, and this is the Walmart Walmart uh, pick that I made. But it still depends on the material that you're gonna use. But basically, they have the same size. 
I mean the thickness will be all up to you like this one is thin I like it thin and this is like thick I mean you can use this for your electric guitars and stuff like that or if you want thick picks but I mean it works it gave you picks you just need to figure out which card or whatever um, works for you so far I think the Walmart gift card will work fine for me and it actually looks better than the other two that I just made uh -huh. so if you want to make your own picks from your old cards or just want to make something cool and give to your friends get the Picapalooza DIY guitar pick maker alright